Good afternoon. Would you please tell us where you're coming from and what brought you to Swiss Medical? We are coming from Israel. I came with my five-year-old son and uh, this is our second time here. My son has autism and we are looking for improvement. We looked for uh, many ways and we heard about the clinic and we were very satisfied with the first treatment. There was some mild uh, improvements. We are still looking for more. But as we understand, each uh, treatment can bring more improvements. And this is what we are hoping for. So, um, what kind of treatments, apart from the stem cells, you tried for your kid and you keep trying like back home? We are trying everything. Speech therapy and swim therapy and play therapy, especially kindergarten. He's really getting all the treatments that we can give him. We hasn't seen a vast improvement. This is why we came here. So after you visited us first time, when was that, by the way? That was in August 23. Was the first time. Yes. Um, how much time uh, passed since you started noticing some changes in your son's behavior? We started noticing uh, improvements right away. Uh, some of them were maybe after a week or two. Uh, some of them uh, became gradually, a bit later. Uh, it's especially improvement in the understanding of speech. He can uh, follow instructions. He understands uh, specific things. He can now uh, undress himself that he couldn't before. Uh, he's more relaxed. He can uh, sit for five, ten minutes uh, with, uh, and uh, stay in the same activity, also in the kindergarten. They told us that he were, before he could sit for three, four minutes, now it's almost double the time. He's improving, improving slowly, but uh, I think consistently. Yeah, for parents, just from my side, for parents having a kid like that, every small um, every small step forward is a big win, right? A yeah, it, it improves the yeah. quality of your life, yes, right? Your yes. life is quite challenging, yes. being a parent of such a kid. Yeah, you're right. Uh, so, um, yeah, and now I lost the track of my, of my questions. Um, so, uh, did you discuss uh, the fact of having a stem cell therapy with your pediatrician and if you had any comments from that side, what were they? Uh, actually, they didn't have a lot of information to give us. We asked a lot of people in Israel, they didn't have a lot of uh, information. Just our neurologist from hospital, he recommended it. He <laughs> said that it's uh, worth a shot, worth a try. Uh, and we consulted a lot of people in Israel that had already been here and they recommended it. Uh, did you have any fear before coming to a foreign country? And if you did, how you overcame this fear? Of course. Oh, first of all, the fear of flying with him. It, it was his first uh, flight. And uh, again, we, we consulted with people who have done it before. And they gave us uh, good advice. And uh, it was okay. It wasn't easy, but it was okay. The last time I remember you came also in a group, there were like uh, three, also uh, Raz Me Meir's family yes. was with you. They were here last week, yeah, you know we that, know. Yeah? yeah? Yeah, we talked that to them. When they came, I remember that uh, you came in a group. Yes. Yeah, so you had some how this, how, some moral support from, from, you supported each other, right? Yes, yeah, it was easier for you mm -hmm. than, rather than coming alone. Uh, so, um, uh, what kind of uh, changes are you hoping to see this time after the second treatment? Uh, our main hopes are to see improvement in speech, to start seeing some words, improvement in the sleep, and uh, improvement in his temperament, to be a bit more relaxed. These are the three main issues. This, the, fir the first and main issue is the speech that we are really ho hoping for. Mm -hmm. Um, can you mention a little bit about the um, the country you are uh, in right now? Your impression about this stuff, the clinic, how you feel here? I think we feel uh, really great here. From the first moment we, we land in the airport until we leave, we are covered uh, with good advice and good treatment, and from the doctors and the nurses and the staff around, we feel welcome. And we feel that uh, every little problem we have is uh, getting solved pretty quickly. And uh, it really, really helps us because it's not easy to be in a clinic in a foreign country for anyone. And especially with a young kid like this, with his uh, specific problem. So 
the main one of the main reasons we came back here, for, except from the the improvements, is the is what we get from the the staff here. It's really it makes uh, feel welcome. Really nice words, thank you. Uh, so, um, have you got any kind of advice you could give to parents being in the same position like you are, being a parent of an autistic kid? Uh, should they give it a shot? I think they should definitely give it a shot. Uh, we had a lot of fears before and they were all answered. The treatment here was great. Unlike any other clinics we've been around in Israel or other places, the clinic here is in a different level. And uh, you should have a lot of patience. That's uh, the main thing we need as families like this. We, have, uh, we need the patience, not to expect uh, re results right away, but gradually I think we, you'll be able to see them. Thank you so much.